Okay, so here is a tip um, on how to boost a new GMB listing up the maps. Uh, this is something I do once in a while. Um, um, it can give you a pretty decent boost um, for a new listing. Um, so let's say for an example, um, you know, I want to rank a site for this keyword, Furnace Repair um, Southfield, Michigan, right? Um, we know what these are, the, the new Google leads. This is Google AdWords. This is the map pack, and this is organic, right? And um, most of the time, if you see the one, two, or three of the listings that come over here are also the top two or three, or at least one, you know, ranked in the top. So in this case, SNM Heating um, is, is number two. SNM Heating. Um, let's see, Edwards Plumbing. Um, Edwards Plumbing is right here. Um, and then responsive mechanical, responsive mechanical, I don't see that. But so we got two out of three in the map pack um, already ranking here. And so this one is pretty much the, the one that carries the most weight, the most authority in Google's eyes. Um, so now assuming I'm putting up a new site, a new, a new lead gen site and a new um, uh, GMB listing, most likely, once once it's verified, it'll be somewhere in the in the bottom. You know, you got to go to more places in the GMB listings and go all the way to the bottom. It might be somewhere here. Um, what I do is when I put up a new listing, um, let's say for example, this is the listing. This is actually not a new listing. This is a pretty uh, old old listing. Uh, but assuming it's a it's a new listing, um, you know, I put up a, a new GMB and a lead gen site, Southfield Furnace Repair. And this is the, the site here. Um, what I would do is I would go to the SERPs here and get the first website, the root domain that's ranking organically. Okay, so ideally one that's ranking organically and in the maps will be awesome. So I will not get a home advisor because that's really um, not the, the root domain that's ranking. But the local site that is ranking for my main keyword, I would copy that. I would go back to my listing and I would just replace that, put that in place of mine and you know leave it for about 24 to 48 hours. And um, what I found is somehow that the, the authority of that, the weight that it carries in, in Google's eyes, that actually boosts my um, Google listing all the way from the bottom to somewhere you know up the ranks. Now, would it get into the three pack? No, not unless it's a very low competitive niche. Um, but most of the time I've seen, you know, if my, my listing was somewhere here, after about 48 hours, it would have moved to, you know, five, six, seven spots over here. And that's a pretty big boost if it's a brand new site, brand new listing. But then after 48 hours, I would come and, um, you know, replace it back with my original, um, original site, you know, which is uh, Furnace Repair Southfield. Michigan.com. So that's what I would do. Now, why 48 hours? Um, the guy who taught me this a um, long time ago, um, he said it worked for 48 hours, and I've been doing it for 24 to 48 hours, and I've seen some increase. You could test it out for less than that, more than that. I'm not sure if anybody else is doing this. I'd love to hear it. But that's a pretty decent boost. And once we have this initial boost, we can then go and do you know our SEO work, the stuff that we know what to do to rank them higher. So if it's a brand new listing. This is kind of a an initial boost to get, especially a maps ranking, by piggybacking off of the the number one ranked um, root domain here. So hope that helps.